Hey guys, RC here, back with episode 6 of Climbing the Ladder, our Football Manager 20 Journeyman Save. Uh, real quick, before we get started, I wanted to pull up my Steam Achievement window, and uh, yeah, so my birthday was May 4th. Uh, I've been talking to you guys about my solo save with Leeds United. We did the Invincibles. We finished the Premier League without a loss. We ended up with uh, 28 or 29 wins and then like nine draws and no losses. Liverpool, we only won by two points because Liverpool lost one game, uh, only drew one game the whole year. And I think they lost six. So they lost 18, they lost 20 points. We lost, you know, nine eight 18 points just on draws so it was close so uh you know it was very close uh but we had the invincible achievement we did the double we actually won the treble but i'd already won uh we won the fa cup the carabao cup which i know doesn't really count and we won the premier league we lost we literally lost one match the entire season it was insane uh, I play it on my laptop while I'm in the living room with my wife and kids watching TV at night. So I can't show it to you because the cloud save doesn't work, which is ridiculous. Uh, but I did post it over at the SI forums in uh, NAP's tactics thread. So it's in there. Uh, I've got the schedule, uh, the, the standings and everything else. Our leading goal scorer scored 46 goals on the season in 41 matches. Incredible. Uh, first big goal scoring season I've had since uh, Guiri, uh, who I've talked to you guys about a lot. Uh, so it might be the greatest individual season by a player, and it's the only invincible season I've ever had. So, I mean, I just want, got the uh, achievement. Uh, but we won the three trophies. We played AC Milan. We played them at Ellen Road in the Champions League semifinals so this was to go to the finals we beat them two to one in the home leg okay we had gotten this uh top form we hadn't lost in 30 matches irresistible force we had scored a goal in 30 consecutive comp competitive matches we had scored at this point we had scored in 23 matches in a row and the previous time was a nil nil draw so we had won the home leg, 2-1. We go to Spain. We play the away leg. 1-0 defeat. So we end up 2-2 on aggregate, and they won on away goals with the one away goal at Ellen Road. That was our only loss of the season. And because they won on away goals, we got eliminated and kept us from being in the Champions League finals which we probably would have won the won the fourth trophy that year and gone unbeaten for the season i was sick i was literally sick but anyway wanted to show you guys the achievements at least so you could see that i was so excited oh my god and you want to talk about stressful because my laptop's pretty slow i can play you know, in a, in a two or three hour window at night watching TV, sitting in the living room, I can play maybe eight, eight or nine matches at most. So, you know, this went on for weeks, you know, this, well, this went on for probably a week and a half to get through this one season. Oh my God. Every time I fired, every time I ended and saved, I was like, oh my God, I'm saving in the middle of this run. You know, but I, you know, I don't have a choice. I got to go to bed and wake up and go to work in the morning and do my job. Um, and then I'd load it up and go, oh my God, we're going to lose today because we've got a fresh load here. And uh, it was just nerve wracking. So anyway, I wanted to share that with you guys. So go Leeds. Uh, very happy with that. T picking up where we left off, we had uh, the friendly. We won 2-1, had a 1-1 league draw. Uh, let, well, let's see. We actually had a handful of friendlies in there. So, uh, you know, the handful of friendlies, and I think we saw that match last time. I don't remember. I don't remember where we were at. I think that's right. I think that's where we left off. We had the 2-1 win and a friendly. 
uh, a 1 1 draw and then a 2 1 win. The draw was tough because uh, the, this league draw was tough because we ended up playing all of our starting guys, and that was my screw up with three days rest. So everybody was like in the 70% range. I mean, we were dead tired. So luckily, we've had a little bit of a break here about a week. We managed the win even with about half the team well below the 90% uh, uh, game readiness threshold that we used. So we're back for SB Reed. They are top of the table today. Uh, we have picked up a couple of wins. So we're sitting on 33 points in fourth position, and we're only supposed to finish mid-table, so we're doing okay. Uh, so let's get to the game today. We are on the road and we are underdogs so we are certainly going to do our away tactic hopefully we have our full complement we do i have gone ahead and made some signings they won't go into effect until july 1st uh, so we are looking at signing some players that will be upgrades for us for next season uh, assuming we're still here which i don't see why we wouldn't be but you know you never ever know all right, so we're going to go with Somner and Kosman up top, Beck and Hrustic on the wings, Petrov, Polisteris, the partnership in midfield, Dreesen and Blazic, center backs, Henneke in the goal, Malisic and Alta Balmer on the wings on the back line. Let's get to it. Decent is lacking match sharpness, but at least we have a full complement of subs. Uh, we, that, that draw that we had, we had to go with five out of seven. We had guys injured. We had guys that were in the 60%. I just couldn't even put them on the field. It was just, it was horrible. So I said, man, I'm going to, I'm going to go out and spend some money. Get a few players for next year. So we aren't dealing with this. All right, there's a ball up. Bad, bad delivery. Oh, there's a good through ball by them. And our keeper just can't make the save. Rainer Deetham with his seventh goal of the season for Reed. Yeah. Now it's time to separate the men from the boys. How about we show some passion? Bornman into the box and a penalty. Smolarek's going to take the penalty for him. Looks like they took a skith and just cut that guy down. Oh, that was ugly. First goal of the season. Of course it is. Welcome to the score sheet, young Michael Smolarek. Probably first goal of his career as well. Not sure if you guys are interested, but there is a uh, horse racing game out there called Starters Order 7. And uh, I picked it up the other day, and I had a hard time figuring it out. But uh, finally figured out some basics, and I went ahead and put uh, put a little four-piece, uh, four-episode tutorial together for it. So if you're into horse racing, maybe check it out. Unsponsored. Just, uh, you know, I buy all my games. I pay full face value, and I'm unsupported. Oh, a save. Hello. All right, they've got five shots, and they're all on target. All right, they're uninterested. Can we uh, can we show some passion again? Hello? Maybe? All right, there's a nice ball up to midfield. We cross midfield, maybe for the first time all match. And it gets poked away by the defense, and they're on the counter. We're looking vulnerable. Oh, and it's over the top. A little flick on header. Alta Baumer gets it back up in the right direction, at least. Petrov. All right, Petrov brings it from left to right. Plays it through. Beck on the wing, and he's fouled. All right. So we're going to have a penalty attempt by Petrov. Oh, and he drills it. He looked just as dominant as their penalty. And we're back within a goal, although I think that's our first. Oh, no, we've had three on target. Hello. Hello. 
Uh, deep ball into the attack zone. Oh, come on. That looked clean. And I and it's a penalty. Shit. I don't think that was a penalty. We're back. I mean, that certainly would not have been a penalty in the Premier League. <laughs> Just letting you know there, Mr. Referee and Smolarik. I've got my second goal. He's going to want to be playing against us every match the rest of his career. Oh, dear God. How about get creative? Oh, they're inspired. Except for Blazic. He's furious. How dare you tell me to get creative? <laughs> hey, move my little uh, microphone there just a little bit. We haven't been outplayed. We've just been outplayed. We've been outscored. That's 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 it. All right, you avoid a booking, please. Yeah, nobody's playing total crap. Oh, lumped into the box and a header goes over our goalkeeper. Well, I knew this was going to be a rough one. I didn't want to just completely get my ass kicked, but I knew it was going to be rough. Let's encourage him. All right, we had a header on goal. Nice. We're going to encourage him. Yeah, that's it. We're getting blown out, so come on. You guys can do better. I have faith in you. All right, Dreesen, let's bring on Carlos Villar back. We're going to get you off. Now, you cannot play mid-right. You know what? I'm going to drop Kosman back there, and then I'm going to bring Barsanti up top. Kosman can't play mid-right, but he can play attacking mid-right, and, and it is a it is a, an attacking position. So, oh, so he went up and got that ball. Malsek, good job. Oh, intercepted by Hustick. Good. Find Somner. And he takes a shot from range. Can't get around on it. Good. All right. Let's push forward. All right. Petrov picks up a yellow card. Oh, there's a nice interception. Somner. Oh, he's in a one on one. Oh, he pokes it through. There's Kosman. Kosman lays it through and it's in. Yes. Four to two. Huh. I know we're not going to win, but that looks a lot more palatable than four one. Holy crap. All right. Sorry, that was kind of an important text. My, uh, my son is a cancer survivor. He's 18. Uh, what do we want to do here? I want to pull him off. How about we go with Ellers? Ellers can play left, so I'm assuming he can play right. It's the same position, just the other foot, yeah? I'm going to go with that. We ended up with more shots. Oh. Hustick. Over the top. There's a header. Oh, it just goes wide. I don't think we played poorly here, guys. I'm going to take a moral victory here. I know they're worthless, but hey, you guys did great in the second half. I'm going to call that a win. I'm going to call that that we did a good job. All right, we'll be back for the next match here in just a second. All right, we're playing Team Furwain. Furwain. I don't know if that... I don't know. Something like that. The fact team. Fact you. Fact off. I don't I don't know. Demonetize. Not making money. All right, we're home. We are favored. So we're gonna kick over to our home tactic. Thankfully, we're getting back to full match fitness that or condition. That's good. All right. We have signed uh two two or three players. That'll be coming in in July, so looking forward to that. There's some good-looking players. We've confirmed them, so we can uh, we can look at them if you want. I believe we are in the red once again. All right, we get the early shot. 
we're pretty heavily favored, so let's get a little creative. Thank you. All right, into the box. There's a header, and Andres Blazik puts his first goal in for the season. Daniel Beck with the assist, and we're up 1-0 in the 20th minute. Got to like that. Set piece goal. All right, we are going to give them an early praise call. Ooh, they're fired up. We're at least composed. Blazik was calm after his goal. All right, they've gotten a couple of shots back. Pretty close here. Uh oh, a late highlight here in the second in the in the half. All right, there's a nice header out. All right. Oh no! And oh god, our keeper was completely caught out of position. I am seriously questioning Henneke as our keeper here. That's brutal. That was a nice little entry pass for them. Right, we've only managed two shots here. Um, I am going to go. Oh, I just screwed up. All right. I don't know what I hit. I screwed up the mouse click. All right. Show some passion. That fires us up, but they get the highlight. Oh, there's a nice interception. Good job. Lumped forward. That's not good. Polisteris comes up and makes the attack. Gets it into Kossman. And that, Hen Henneke, is how you make a save, sir. Take some notes from their goalkeeper. All right, Beck. Into the box. Oh, it dropped through. They're on the counter. Coming up the left side, do not stomp him. All right, well, that was a good tackle, and it went out for a throw-in. Very key positioning on that. All right. Let's go ahead, and Malisic is struggling. Let's bring, uh, let's bring Mark Kurt on out there. And let's bring Barsanti on up top. And let's tell him to show some passion. All right, we get fired up. Come on, boys. All right, Hamadovic. That's their guy. All right. All right, let's pull a late sub here. Let's go for Dreesen and bring on Carlos Villar. More time wasting than anything else. All right, Kurt into the box. Oh, it's headed away. And a straight red card for Palisteris. We're already in the hole here. All right. Somner can only play up front. Can Beck move? Not really. Let's drop let's drop him here and we'll make him support. Yeah, we'll do that. All right, that's a good header. All right, Beck on the attack. He's got two crosses. Oh my god, he had a cross and he couldn't they couldn't connect. There it is! Oh, an unlucky block and then a great save by the keeper. All right, we should get one more opportunity here. No, that was it. Blow the whistle. Blow the whistle. Don't blow the whistle. Give us another minute. Play it through. There. Oh, that was a good-looking pass, too. All right, well, at least we didn't have to pay the piper for that red card, but ugh, we did we did, we, uh, we needed to win that game. Uh no, we're going to go aggressive and yep, screw you guys. Screw you guys. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that was one we needed to win, man. I mean, 
Well, actually, in all fairness, they're in third position, right? So, yeah, okay, maybe I maybe I was a little rough there. A little rough, and we're going to find him the two weeks wages. All right, so that has us in fifth position, but we're we're right there anywhere but, you know, from third to, to ninth. Let's go ahead. I mean, that's a pretty good run we've been on here, you know, two losses in, you know, three months so pretty happy let's come back for let's come back for lens and dornburn 1913 and then we'll come back for bacher modeling and lustenau and that'll be the season finale so two more episodes this season we'll see how that looks what did i say lens and dornberg so yeah we'll see you guys in a couple of a uh, couple of matches We'll see. We'll do that one. Uh, well, you'll either see it tomorrow or Monday, depending on what day this one goes up. Because we only take Sundays off unless something happens in life and I can't get to recording. Hit that like button for me. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. And thank you so much for the continued support. You'll never know how much it means. Have a good one, guys. Bye.